So I've come to the conclusion that most of my interviews are virtual and it's been like that for a year now. And I have some tips that I think will help out uh, with other nurses to land some jobs. Uh, the job market is, is pretty good for nurses right now, um, but some people just don't know how to interview. I can count on one hand how many jobs I did not get. Uh, I think it was like two jobs that I didn't get. Most of the jobs I end up getting the offer at the end. And they usually say I did pretty good during the interview. So I think you have to be prepared for what you what to expect, basically. And I get asked the same questions throughout most of these interviews. I keep me a notebook full of scenarios that I either pre-written or just examples of what I want to say. And most of the interviews ask me the same stuff. So if you're going into like ICU or anything critical, they want to know about the most critical patient you've taken care of. Have a great example about that. Write it down. Make sure it makes sense. Make sure it's ethical and protocol and, you know, have steps to it. Something they can follow. Keep that same story. Don't change it. Don't spruce it up. The more you tell it, the better it gets. Have a good example about the most critical patient you have. Also have a good example about teamwork. Uh, anytime that you had downtime and you helped out with other patients, stuff like that, have that written down. Don't change it, keep that example. Have a great example about um, how you'll be an asset and what, you know, tell me about yourself, your strongest weakness and all that. Have good examples about that. Have the same one, do not change it. Write it down, keep it near you. I'm not telling you to read it during the interview. Don't do that. But it's it's good to have near you just in case, you know, you, you could probably be like, you know, <laughs> I don't do that. But it's definitely helpful. The most important to me that lands me these jobs is have a separate section. I have a section at the bottom about the organization that I'm interviewing for. Have their values and tie that into your characteristics and how you feel like you'll be a good fit and how they are a good fit for you and how you align with those values. Have that written down. Have any new researches, protocols, that changes in their organization, they will be impressed. I also have questions for them as well. I always ask about the challenges that the unit is facing, how would the staff describe the management style, and scheduling, you know, stuff like that. The culture of the unit, stuff, you know, stuff that helps you out. I kind of start stuttering. Whatever. But yeah, all of these helps out and you look like you're down for, you're here for business. You're interviewing them just as much as they're interviewing you and you'll look professional and you'll.